barely 24 hours after Rita Dominic's traditional wedding that broke the internet, her husband, Mr. Anosiki, has been called out in different social media platforms for different um, not-so-good reasons um, or not-so-good things, rather, which we pray and hope is not true. Whether these people are clutch chasing or not is still not ascertained. But whatever be the case, let's be happy and pray for the best in her marriage, as this is rather too early. I will be reading out um some of the posts and comments are shown on the screen. The first person here said the guy has money, but he has anger issues. And then the other person says she was warned, but I think Rita Dominic was warned, according to her, but she won't marry. Maybe the guy don't change. And then another person said, I thought this is the third marriage. Sometimes it doesn't work. It doesn't always follow like that. I think this person is kind of counting how many times the guy has been married or something. Um, another person said... Real prayer case because the man is a serial divorcee. She will be wife number four. I pray it works for her. Another person said, this guy is fascinated by her stardom. He is, mar he is not marrying the woman, but a superstar. She's a trophy wife, and that is the problem. And then the other person said, I wish them the best. And there is this particular um, Twitter handle that struck me. I don't know if this particular person is cloud chasing because, I mean, everything was so evident. He did not hide his handle and all that. Probably looking for uh, followers or something. I don't know. But I just hope um, this is not cloud chasing. Or rather, I just hope he's cloud chasing and not trying to, um, and this is not true. But if he's cloud chasing, I pray they follow this up because this is to the extreme. He said, can Rita, um, Dominic's husband, pay my sister the several decade that he has been owing her since last year? What manner of wickedness is this? And this is from a Twitter handle, Vulcan, all right? So you can go check it out and find out what I have. I'm saying, like, I just feel that this is so early. People calling her out or calling her husband out or something at this early stage of their marriage is uncalled for. I mean, for this Twitter handle, is even the most annoying one because if uh, actually the man is owing your sister since last year, why haven't you called the man out since? Why must it be after her marriage or after their marriage that you're calling them out if you're not cloud chasing? And then what have you informed or have you made me out? Or is there measures rather to um kind of get Rita to know about this if this is actually true? Like, I just feel that from what I heard about this particular person, the man is a billionaire. So, I mean, what is 700K and all that? But then I, I, I just feel that this guy is like chasing or something because owing your sister 700K, what kind of business transacted between them? And if actually he's owing your sister 700K, why haven't you, you know, um, called him out, confronted him or something since? Why must he be after their wedding why must it be during their happy time let's stop um um attacking people or anything during their happy moments okay you had all the whole time since last year on, up until their wedding to call him out or say things like this but you didn't you had to wait till after their wedding because you know they are trending and of course anything you put out about them at this point were actually trained and that was when um you decided to call him out and for those um that are dropping comments about rita being warned and all the rest of them please um the fact that it happened to another person doesn't mean it will happen to this other person that is one secondly i'm very sure um, rita did her background check before going into this marriage so let's not act as if the person involved here is a baby rita is not a baby and of course, I'm not sure this is the first man that has asked this man, this lady's hand in marriage. So let's not make it look like she doesn't know what she wants for herself. Okay, all we have to do at this point is to pray for the best and pray that the marriage, you know, 
becomes or is a successful one and aside that that this is a lifetime thing for the two of them i wish rita and anosiki um, mr anosiki well in their home this marriage shall be fruitful and it shall last for a lifetime please let's pray for them and leave the negativity out of it until i come your way with another video bye, -bye.